So somebody asked, why am I planting cool weather crops out here in 110 degrees? And we're not really promised a, a mild winter and we didn't even really get a spring. We went straight from 40 degrees into 90. That's what all the tornadoes and horrible storms were about in this area. And the last season happened like that also. I do believe it's because we're having a solar minimum. I mean, we're not keeping all the, uh, see that rot right there? We're not keeping all of our cold weather squashes and stuff like that. Some of them are inevitably dying and, and there's really nothing we can do about that other than to stop growing them and we're not going to. We're trying to get as much of a harvest as we can while we can. We've extended our growing season on chance and it seems to be working except for right here where this thing doesn't want to climb up the rope I gave it I will grab onto a dead stick I do not want your help Ernie there's weeds mixed all in there too This is buttercup on this side, and there's a bunch of them. I do need to trim out some of the dead leaves. I see a rotted one down there. Um, but for the most part, they're doing really good. Um, this is not bad for two seeds. This isn't bad at all. Two seeds. Um, we've dropped a little bit of fertilizer, but not much. And this is butternut on this side also. Do you want to? Do you want to see how? Look at that. Bindweed has found its way in the mix. That's a no-no. Now, it's getting harder and harder to keep, this is the mulberry tree, it's actually, remember I told you I thought it died, and it found shoots coming out of the bottom of the trunk? Anyway, we're trying hard to keep this pumpkin. In one spot, and there it is, moving along again. That way it's easy to mow around. And this is another Aradali. Um, it's got a baby on it right there. And I need to move it. I was going to give it to a friend and then when she came by she forgot to grab it. Hello sunflowers. Hello, Alibaba.